Alright, so at least once in your lifetime you have accidentally deleted files or formatted an SD card and you're like, damn, I really need those pictures, it's like a family picture or you just need those files, right? And you're wondering, how do I really get this? Is it even possible? You probably heard about people recovering data, but you don't know how to do it. Well, I have an application that you can actually get for free that will actually help you recover data from an SD card, from an external USB, an external hard disk, an internal hard disk, or pretty much any storage device, and you can recover any deleted file from it. So yeah, it's a free software. There is always a paid version to it. And I'm gonna be reviewing the application for you. So this is not a sponsored video. So you will be hearing my honest opinions and honest thoughts about this. So you got nothing to worry about. Let's jump into the computer and take a look at this application. Let's begin. All right, so this is the software basically as you can see. And this is where you get it from. It's called iTrade Data Pro. Uh, you can get the free edition. It costs nothing. And you can store up to one gigabyte for free as you can see. And also, if you can get the pre version like I did a week ago or so, um, it's $50, I believe. And also, there's an Android version so you can recover your data even if your factory is at your phone and stuff, which is like a complete freeware. Uh, but this is what I have, that's what we're gonna focus on. It's called iCare Data Recovery. So, this is my SD card basically, and that is like a video that I recorded. So, take a look. Okay, so this is this test file that I created, and I deleted it once again just for the recovery part. And yeah, it's a quick video. I want to recover and show you that the recoveries actually work. Okay, yeah, so that was what I was gonna like delete. So as you can see, there you go. I just permanently deleted it, not like recycle bin delete. And then on the software, there's three options. Deleted file recovery is what we're gonna go to. That's like the first option. And then you just locate the SD card and it says like, if this doesn't work, go into the deep recovery and we just press okay. And immediately it detected the file. Obviously there were not a lot of files, so it's easy to get detected. And all you gotta do is just find somewhere to like recover it to. Let me go and recover it. There you go. And it recovers like that. We just did that within like 10 seconds. Like that's that's fast. And let me go and locate it. It says recover data. And there you go. I had the same video file. Now let's say that you know that didn't get detected because probably if you did a format on the SD card or something furthermore than just deleting. Then you would have to go into the option that says deep recovery where it would actually scan into deleted files that were even formatted even if it was overwritten and stuff like that. And then there's also a lost partition which you can do, use to you know recover old hard disks and stuff like that. But quick thing that I want to say is when I actually use this software, I did this thing where I recorded like a one gigabyte file and I deleted it, like formatted deleted it and I wrote on my SD card once again to, to its max capacity and then I tried my deep recovery and it didn't work. So if you write about one gigabyte and then you format it and you rewrite on it and fill up the whole SD card, it won't be able to be recovered. But if you write about one gigabyte of a file and then you just format it or delete it or do whatever, and as long as you don't overwrite it like to the full capacity of the SD card, it should be recoverable, if that makes sense. So yeah, that is the end of the video guys. Thank you so much for making it all the way to the end. Tomorrow I'm doing a video where I'm going to be turning my old laptop into a Linux or a Chromebook, whether whatever I choose to do. And so stay tuned for that. And yeah, this is Tech Alpha signing off for today's video. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like and subscribe and turn on post notifications. And yeah, I'm signing out. Peace.